So this was basically Thursday, uh, March 2018, Tri Series going on. Uh, and I was sitting in that crowd of whatever 300, 500 people, and uh, there was this young girl who was sitting two steps down to me, a white kid. Uh, 11 o'clock in the morning, so went to school with her mom and dad. So she was basically traveling to the right side for about 100 meters or so, thrice or four times. Came back a little sad. I just went and asked her dad, what's the thing going on? So basically, her dad told that there are three commentators there and she wants to meet them. Uh, but because the security isn't allowing, this is not happening. So I told, okay, I run this platform which had some 4,500 Twitter followers then. Can I take a picture of her? So I took a picture of her, tweeted it, uh, saying that this girl is smiling and everything. Uh, and Mel immediately replies, hang on tight, we are coming. So Mel was in the commentary that time. So Isa and Anjum came down. They sat in the crowd for about 10 minutes, signed her bag, uh, chanted. that uh, come on this Sunday, there's an India-England match, I'll help you meet all the cricketers. So yeah, and then Mel also came, Mel also sat, all those things happened. Sunday again, we were invited, uh, so this little girl is called Durga, um, Isa comes down after the match, takes her to uh, the, the dressing room, meets, uh, lets her meet all the cricketers and I think that just made Durga stay. That was when I also thought originally that women's cricket needs to start as a business. Yeah, they have been champions of the game right from when they used to play now in the commentary box and uh, being promoters of the game otherwise. Uh, I think these three and a lot of others have been primarily responsible for the growth of women's cricket that we see today. Happy birthday Anjum, happy birthday Isa.